next step in dumbbells. So uh, by now he knows the command hold and uh, uh, he also knows to move a little bit towards me when I call him so kind of uh, uh, does the movement and so what I want to do next is that to uh, start teaching him to pick it up. So first let me show you where we at with the uh, uh, in the exercise so you want to make sure that your dog knows uh, uh, at least that before you move on to more complex which is picking up. So I, uh, I use the PVC pipe, that's what I had, but for the picking exercise I have a PVC pipe on uh, kind of wooden rolls, I'll show you closer. And so uh, it's just easier for the dog to pick up. And uh, today I'll be using this instead of my regular PVC pipe. So what do we know so far? Come on, sit, good boy, sit, hold, good hold, very good hold, right? good boy. So as you can see, he easily holds, he doesn't need any encouragement, he knows to take it in his mouth. Then what we did was moving, hold, sit, come, bring, good, come, bring, Good, yeah, good boy. So we do this a little, for a little bit longer eight distances. Uh, and so, but you can see the dog knows clearly what the exercise is about. So now it's the time to teach him to pick it up. So for picking up, what I have is um, my regular at home command. He also knows, give it to me. When we play with the toys and when I want him to give the toy or pick it up and give it to me. So today I'm going to be relying on this at home command, uh, which is give it to me. And then I also want to make sure when he picks it up, he doesn't chew, right? So I need to watch clearly. And I haven't tried that. So what you guys will see, this is the very first time he's doing it. So hopefully we'll achieve, hey, stop watching birds. Hopefully we'll achieve the success. Okay, I'm going to use treats. Uh, and uh, if he does it successfully, I'm going to use a higher reward, which is the toy. So, how are we going to do? Can you guys see? Come over here. Good boy. Give it to me. Oh, that was perfect! Yay! Good boy! Yay! Very good! I didn't expect him to do it from the first time. So he knows the command, give it to me, because we do it with all the toys. Come on! Let's try again. But hmm, that worked. Sit. Good boy. Give it to me. Give it to me. Hold. Yes. Very good. Good boy. Yeah. Very good. Yay. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. So <laughs> I don't want the dog to be anywhere on the sides. Hey, hey. Give it to me. Hey. Uh, I want to be so him sitting, then the dumbbell, then me, because that's the movement pretty much when he'll be coming back to you in the exercise in IGP, and I kind of want to keep it that way. So uh, nothing kind of on the side or uh, running all from me. We're not ready yet. He just needs to know to give it to me when I'm asking him. So again, I'm putting it here. Grabbing some treats. No, no, hang on. Hang on. You wait here. Wait here. Give it to me. No. Give it to me. Good. Hold. Yes, very good. <laughs> he kind of held it crookedly, but he didn't chew, and I like it. Good boy. Let's try again. Let's try again. Come on. Sit. Good boy. Give it to me. Hold. Aye. Very good. Yay! You're a pro. Good boy. We'll finish at that. And yeah, that was great, actually. Fairly straightforward. So you can.
can see how sometimes at home commands can help guide the dog but again I want to refer you back to my um, uh, video that I posted long long time ago about the vocabulary please use vocabulary with your dogs because it really helps navigate and it helps in training happy training